Hey guys, in this video, we're going to talk about Boyce Law. Boyce Law is one of the law in gas law. So, pressure is inversely proportional to volume and temperature is constant. This is what Boyce Law tells you. So, it means that when your pressure increases, volume decreases. When your volume increases, pressure decreases while your temperature is constant all the time. The concept is very simple. When you have a container and it's in bigger volume, the pressure will be lower. When you compress it into a smaller size, then the pressure will increase while the temperature is constant. So let's try an example. Before you compress, let's say the pressure is 10 Pascal and the volume is 50 cm cube. Then after you compress it, what is the pressure when your volume is 10 cm cube? So here comes to another formula. In our formula, it is P1V1 equals to P2V2. What is 1, 2? 1 is like before. 2 is like after. P, pressure, V, volume. So it is like comparing the pressure and the volume. What we gotta do is putting all the information into the formula. So P1, 10, V1, 50, P2, don't know, V2 is 10. So after that, after calculation, we get P2 equals to 50 Pascal. So from here, we can conclude that your pressure increases when your volume decreases. And how much it increases depends on how much it decreases like decrease by 5 times so increase by 5 times. So why does it happen like that? It's because that your molecules are moving in a smaller space, therefore they have more number of collisions. This is the reason why pressure will increase. So these two points are the most important points to help you explain why Boyle's law happens in that way. And what you do not write is you cannot say that the particles are moving faster, therefore they have more collisions. This is totally wrong. Because that, you do not gain extra kinetic energy from heat energy because the temperature is constant all the time. So remember, smaller space causes more collision. Leave a comment below, let me know if you have any question. Goodbye.